Uh, mwenyekiti wa kampuni ya Kenya Airways bwana Ivanson Mwaniki Mkurugenzi mkuu Buvingunze wanachama wa halmashauri ya wakurugenzi wa Kenya Airways wanahisa wakilishi wa vyombo vya habari wageni mashuhuri mabibi na mabwana nachukua fursa hii kuwakaribisha katika mkutano huu wa kila mwaka wa 39 wa Kenya Airways hapa Pride Center There being a quorum of members present I declare the meeting duly constituted In our opinion the financial statements give a true and fair view of the consolidated and company financial position of Kenya Airways Limited at 31st March in accordance with international financial reporting standards and the Kenya Companies Act. Good morning to all our shareholders. Hamjambo. On behalf of the board and management, I would like to warmly welcome you all to this year's AGM that comes at a crucial time for the business when we reported a significant loss for the financial year 2014-15. There is a big issue about the 60 billion and whether the government is going to give us a check. I am looking at Kamal Vuga to see whether he came with his checkbook, but I'll ask him to, to answer that question himself. Uh, thank you very much, um, Alex. Um, let, me, let me start by uh, noting the passion, uh, Mr. Kimolo's passion, um, uh, but also tell him not to believe everything he reads in the press. Uh, the Kenya government is not broke. Uh, and I'd like to emphasize that in no uncertain terms. Mambo yale ambayo imetendeka from January up to this time, I'm very much worried. Something went wrong somewhere last year. Last year, I didn't manage to attend AGM simply because I never got any information. During the announcements, announced it through mother tongue so that every single member to be aware that AGM is going to be held such and such a date. When we met last year, I think the assurance that you gave us, Buana MD, we never thought that uh, we'll be talking of what we are talking today. But it has happened. I think it is good to call a spade a spade. When the company is in red, say it is in red. But you know there is sometimes when you give hope. But the hope you are giving, maybe the company could be in the ICU. But at the same time, even being in the red, we can't die before we are killed. This airline today is operating. We carry 10 to 12,000 people every day successfully across our network. What we need is to make sure we have the right financial structure to secure the long term. The government is not going to put 60 billion Kenya shillings in, in Kenya Airways. So we are not asking the government of Kenya to put in 60 billion into KQ. I wish the company, the board, the shareholders, staff, everyone, all the very best for the future. Let's work together to restore this airline profitability so that we can continue to claim to be the pride of Africa. So thank you very much and God bless you. Tumefika tamati ya mkutano huu na tunashukuru nyote ambao mleweza kujiunga nasi hivi leo. Huko mkijiandaa kuelekea nyumbani. Tunaomba Mwenyezi Mungu awafikishe nyumbani salama hadi tukutane tena mwaka mwingine. Kwaherini na asante.